wait a minute. Let me plug it in. Don't put your lid on yet. Is that cute or what? Oh, now see, that's going to get hot again. I ordered toilet paper. Okay, I ordered toilet paper. Why isn't it making a noise? Just trust me. Before I can't do... Before I can't... Before I can't... Before I can't... Just throw them in there. I don't know what we were thinking. We're going to leave all of the things on it. Oh, now see, it's going crazy here. I'm stumped. Now I'm back. Hi everybody, welcome back. It's been a while since I've made a cooking video, especially an instant pot video. So I thought today's a good day to do that. Why? Let me show you why. And if my camera was blurry just then, I'm sorry. I don't know what happened there. In this bag, this magic bag, I have the only beets that grew in my garden. Well, let me rephrase that. The only beets that Bigfoot didn't get to. Bigfoot ate the rest of them, but that is it. This is all that I have. All of my beets, and they're dirty beets. They're dirty beets. And they're wilty because I picked them yesterday. They weren't wilty when I picked them, but I stuck them in the refrigerator because I didn't have time, but I wanted to pick them before it snowed. It didn't snow, but it was frosty out. We're gonna do these beets in the instant pot. We're not gonna cook them all the way, but I'm gonna get the skins off these beets because I'm gonna I'm gonna can these beets. I am. I'm gonna can is that crazy or what? There's not a lot there, but I'm gonna can the beets and I'm gonna make a video canning these beets. I'm also gonna can carrots with the beets, so then it makes sense. Running the canner for one jar, I I don't know. But anyway, now I'm babbling. But we're going to wash the beets, wash the beets, and then we're going to put them in here. And I'll show you this magic trick that I learned. Now you're in my sink, and I think I fixed the problem with the blurry lens. I can't bend over. I just can't bend over that far. I'm stumped. Okay, got it. We took the camera to the water park, and I bet there was water drips on the camera that dried. And yeah. So anyway, look my new addition. Is that cute or what? I've got that new addition to the kitchen. All right, now back to the beets. Now, now we can do the beets. All right, I had to show you my flying pink thing. I just thought that was the cutest thing ever. So we've got these couple of beets. And I don't think I'm gonna save the beet tops. Where's, okay, knife. I don't, I don't think I'm gonna save these because I just don't think I'm gonna. But we're gonna cut them about that much off. My other knife is in the dishwasher or I would be using that. And this water is getting really hot. So we're just going to cut them because you don't want them, you don't want them to bleed. And what I mean by bleeding, you'll have red water. We really don't want red water. So we're going to cut the beets, just cut, cut that little top off. So nothing can escape from the top here. You don't want that to happen. And after we cut these, we're gonna wash them in this daggone hot water here. I really need to turn this down. I should do that. Gosh, you know what I'm thinking? I think I need another camera set up here. Now, oh, now the beach are splashing me. I'm tired of bending over like this. So we're gonna, we're gonna think something else here. Maybe I'll hang you. I don't know what I'm gonna do, but uh, there. I think that's, oh, there's a little tiny. Oh, there's a baby. Now we're gonna wash them. I really need to work on my tripod a little bit. I have one of those Joby tripods. Oh, now see, that's gonna get hot again. Oh, pay attention. The Joby tripod is all messed up from the water park. It's going every which way. And of course, my well's gonna be running, but because I'm running the water and the washing machine is running, I don't know if you could hear that. Okay, that's one clean beat. We're gonna leave all of the things on it, the little root, and that you want to leave that on there just trust me we probably don't need to leave that much on there but we're going to and you want to get these clean let me tell you this story my daughter was into that juicing business she still is and she came over one day and she's like mom taste this i added beets to it i'm like all right we could do that i'm like I really, well first of all we had a little slight little just, I don't want to taste it. I just don't want to. Oh, you have Again, the dog barks. Can't make a video around here without the dog barking. So anyway, she said, you, Mom, seriously, you have to taste this. So I tasted it, 
and it was the nastiest drink I've ever had, honestly. And I said, this tastes terrible. She goes, I know, but it's good for you. I'm like, did you wash your beets first? Did you wash them? No, why? I said, because they taste like dirt. Does this not taste like dirt to you? She said, yeah, a little bit, but I thought it was supposed to taste that way. No, wash your beets. You have, even, even if you make, I'm sorry for all the noises, but I can't help that. Even if you make the green juice, wash, wash your beets because they'll taste like dirt. You'll taste it. Even if you boil them, you'll taste it. That's a nice beet. I wish all of them were that size. I did have a lot of big beets out there before. We, it's really big so I didn't get them. I'm just making that up. And Rob is home. Just in time. He went to get lunch. He's working on his truck. So he had to go to the park store and said, do you want me to get lunch? And I'm like, yeah. He said, like, what do you want? And I said, like, surprise me. Let's go see what he surprised me with. You want to know what we're having for lunch? I don't even know what we're having for lunch. We're having chicken. I know where it came from. Chicken. Did you get me chicken too? Nope. Would you get me a Whopper? a Whopper? I would rather have the Whopper. He knows. He knows that. Do you want to say hi to the people? Hi, people. I'm doing. I'm doing my beets video. Your beets video. Who are you mm -hmm. beating? Yeah, nobody. No, all those little beets over there. I'm gonna key in them today. All three of them. All three of them with <laughs> the uh, the carrot. I'm gonna can carrots and potatoes. We're gonna can potatoes too. We have a busy day ahead of us. Lots of videos to shoot today. That means lots of editing on my part, but that's okay because I like to edit. Now in the Instant Pot, the beets that we just washed, just throw them in there. Throw them in there. Easy as can be. I wish I had more beets, but we don't and that, that's okay. I don't know why I'm canning these when we could just eat them, but I want to can them. And then to that, I have a cup of water here. Just in there just in there pour it in there and then put your lid on okay pour see my countertops nothing fits under these we weren't th we weren't quite thinking i don't know what we were thinking when we we designed the kitchen i i should have measured appliances and then the, put the counters in but that didn't happen that way so we have we just adjust all right put your lid on you ready oh wait a minute let me plug it in don't put your lid on yet. I like to hear the noise that the Instant Pot makes. You ready? Why isn't it making a noise? Oh, I know why. Take the lid back off, Michelle. Plug it in in the back. All right, make sure, make up oh, that seat. Make sure it's plugged in the back. I've had that problem couple times had to call a friend had to phone a friend about that one she said Michelle oh, see? she said Michelle plug it in oh now see it's going crazy here all right did you hear that all right I'm over that now all right you ready make sure it is on seal not vent now we're gonna push pressure cook oh let's do five minutes what the heck and that's it that's it now you wait I'm gonna let this vent for a little while not long until I eat my lunch and then we'll, then we'll be back it's been 25 minutes so I'm sure it's vented good and of course there goes the well we wait it's done I've been on the phone with UPS. We have a lost Amazon package. First, we're going to vent this. <laughs> Get it? I'm going to vent. I'm going to vent too. We vent the pot and you're going to hear me vent in a minute. Open the pot. Away from you. Ouch. Oh, don't touch that part. That's hot. Away from you. Come on. and they did bleed a little bit and by bleeding I mean the red came out that's all I mean by bleeding but Amazon I ordered toilet paper okay I ordered toilet paper let me move this lid out of the way I don't want to get it wet hold on I don't even know I don't even know where to put good enough 
I guess I'm not prepared right now. Amazon, you have me flustered. I need a bowl. I'll just, I'll just get all the bowls. That's what we'll do. I've got the bowl with the holes in it, and we're gonna dump this hot beet stuff for the cold water on. But we're gonna dump this pot into there, and I probably need pot. No, I don't. But trust me, it's going into here. I'll bring you over in a minute so you can see my five little beets. Let me rearrange. See, Amazon? See? Now, you need to run cold water over this, like so. But I ordered toilet paper. Now to my Amazon story. I ordered toilet paper. How many times am I going to start this story? Probably a lot. It got lost. It got lost somewhere in shipment. And now you want to cut the end off, okay? Now is a good time to cut the ends off and watch. The skins, they, the skins come right off. See, watch, the skins come off. They should, sometimes they can just, you can just tear them off. Well, Amazon said my order was delivered by UPS. No, no, it wasn't. No UPS man was here yesterday. There's no box of toilet paper on my front porch. I don't know where it went. Maybe the UPS driver said, oh, hey, she ordered toilet paper. We need some at my house and took my toilet paper. All right, we're going to put these into this clean bowl. It's clean now. Oh, look it. See that one, how it just comes off? Woo! That one just popped right out of my hand. That's what you should be able to do. And then just cut this off. Cut the tips off and put them in your bowl. Let's see if we can do that to another one. See, yep, see how easy it comes apart? Just in your Instapot for, it was five minutes, but it vented for way too long. It probably didn't need to vent that long, but that's okay, it did it anyway. And I don't even know where I was in my story. I've got the well going on behind me and I've got beets popping everywhere. Let's see, just give it, see how it all just comes off so easy. Just throw it in your Instant Pot. I used to boil the beets. Before the Instant Pot, you boiled the beets. Don't have to do that anymore. Here, makes it so easy. Here's my own, well, I got two nice size beets. I hope these should fit in the canning jar. My one, one canning jar full of beets. But anyway, and oh, I know, I know where I was going with this story. I was on the phone with UPS, which God love her. I'm glad pe people need jobs. I understand that. I could not understand the Amazon or the UPS lady. She was talking so fast. I just could not understand her. And I had to repeat my email address so many times because she, she was just typing away. But I'm getting it wrong. She got it wrong three times. And I was speaking clearly and loud. I was. I should have filmed that. Me screaming my, ad, my email address at the woman. All right, that one's clean. Oh, it doesn't. No, nope, got a spot. I thought I had a spot. That's all you do to get the skins off the beets. How easy is that? And they just come off in your hands. Use your Instant Pot. Now, I'm running a collaboration, which I've not been really good at keeping up with, but I need, I'll get better. I promise I'll get better at this. But if you want to make a video, hashtag Let's Instant Pot. I'll put it in a playlist of a bunch of other videos that are in there, other, other videos. So people can come and look and say, hey, I want to do an Instant Pot thing. And they could find the, just this plethora, plethora, there's another big word, of recipes. Is that cool or what? There, my measly beets. I think that's all of them. Yep, that's it. I hope my garden does better next year because look, that's it. That is it. That is it. I'm going to can them. You hear my well? Oh, jeez. The tripod's all janky. I'm just having a time here. Well, anyway, now the camera's crooked. Before I can't do... Before I clean... Before I can... Before I can the potatoes, I'm all fix my camera. And Rob is in the house. Rob's in the house. Howdy. Thank you for lunch. No problem. Which is in the refrigerator because I can't chew it. I can't chew the hamburger today. I'll, I'll have to eat the baby food because remember I had all this dental work done and I have no teeth. No, not the teeth to chew. I don't have those teeth. 
All right, we're done talking about teeth. Beats easy. Hashtag in, let's instant pot. I'll see you in my next video. I'll see you in my next video. We've got chaos right now, but we've got beats.